Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video. And today in this video, I'm just going to be showing y'all how I like to solo queue and what I do to help my team, but also help myself, just how I play. You'll see, you know what? Let's just get right into it. How are we doing today? What's up guys? I'm gonna kill myself and put you in the note. Okay, so we're very locked in right now. Van Villa. Van Villa. <laughs> Saying Van Villa over and over when it's uh, four to one in votes. Can we get a gang out of here for bank? Van Thatcher. Now we're banning Thatcher. I didn't know that Thatcher Let's was go. that good on bank. I, I didn't know that. What I what I think is solo queues. I think you got to give like. Okay, we're going downstairs. Hold on. Bring a zombie. Okay. No. <laughs> no. Wow, great throw, guys. That's not a throw. Because someone didn't pick a zombie for the security or service room, whatever the fuck it's called. But, um, how I see don't it is. Don't reinforce the wall. Don't reinforce that wall, Legion. Legion, don't reinforce that wall, Legion. Okay. So we're. I mean. Okay. Because mirror. Okay, I can, I can see it. I'm just gonna place mine down here, actually. Just so if they get anywhere within this vicinity, you know, I'm just gonna keep it right there. But how I see solo queue is you gotta like, you gotta be hyping your team up. You, you gotta be the guy that's like, okay, you could get one kill and it could sound cringe, but even if they get one kill, just hype them up because R6 is such an egotistical game. If I just hype someone up after they got one kill, I'm just like, Yo, you're fucking crazy Wait, or don't good shit. That, Lucy, stop. Okay. Sorry, I didn't know you wanted to reinforce the left one. You got a shotgun, never mind. Have one. But, uh, just fucking, like, saying good job, bringing up fucking, like, good shit, guys, good work, team, or some, some random cringy shit. It works. I promise you it works, bro. Good shit. Like something so simple will just bring up some like people's minds because it's a R6 egotistical. I said that so wrong. Yo, can like someone game. hold garage? I got you. Like just helping your team. I have a long angle. Staying in the with them and everything. Mirror's got garage. Dokes and garage. Like giving out call outs, just like solo queue. You got a very you gotta like be with your team. Don't play it like it's solo queue. Don't play like you can't talk. Play it like with, you're with your team. Play it together. Good shit. Like even though you could be the only one, just like, just do it, man. There's nothing wrong. Good shit. Like even though I'm the only one saying that, even though you may have teammates that might get mad or might not even respond. Just the thought in their mind, damn, one person's down. Good shit. That person's mind is hyped up. It's like, okay, this random is complimenting me. He's saying good shit. I'm clearly doing something right here, which he is. So, like, just something so simple. Giving compliments, call outs, talking to your team, asking how their day was. This team is not the best team I've came across in solo queue. Usually when I start talking and all that, the team will start talking and we'll all start amping each other up. Like I had this one game I really wish I would have recorded. It sounded like we were playing in a five stack, how great it was. Everybody played ops together, talked, calmed, and it went from a silent round to me slowly bringing up the mood. And it did go down when we lost the match. But you see, when you lose, you can't just stop talking. When you lose in the R6, bro, everyone just be giving up. Don't let that happen, okay? Don't. Hey, drone. I don't know. I think I'm just gonna play sight. I mainly just pick fucking dock because I can stay my teammates if they do get knocked. And fucking, um, what's it called? And because, uh, the P90 with the ACOG. 
absolute no recoil. It's a beast. It's insane. I don't like. I like this, I guess, but that we want control of that room. So I kind of wish he didn't do that. I didn't place my cam. Oh shit! So I'm just gonna place it right here. We can just jump in. Gotta watch out for people playing on Raptors. I really wish he didn't put this here. I'm taking that out. Sorry, but that's just a horrible move, Castle. He's on repel. So, I'm pretty sure almost all my bullets hit them. There was no way, and he had a tick of HP off. But there's nothing we can do about that. Uh, let's see what cams we got. I got your lounge cams. They know I got them if anybody comes in lounge. There's somebody on repel behind you, zombie. Like, close. One ping. Giving out just simple comms. Checking cams. Play slow. I don't be scared of talk, and obviously this is gonna be those people, even these people, like that will just yell or be like, "Shut the fuck up!" Like that's just R six. But like, just try your best. Thirty seconds left. He hit the goo mines. Anything? Good shit. Egotistical game. <laughs> and now we're gonna continue with some gay shit. I want your meat in my mouth. I'm not playing the best right now, but I'm hyping up my team. I'm giving them call outs. I'm telling them fucking. I'm just telling them such simple things that can still help. Like, I got your lounge cam. Okay, Kate doesn't have to turn around and watch lounge every second. If I hear someone, I'll ping it, I'll let them know. Like, to such simple things. Go Valk. Let's play for information. But the thing is, the one thing of like playing operators to help with information is when your team doesn't call Protect out. Like, bombs. someone could die and not even touch my Valk cams. Not even be calling out a single thing on Valk cams. But it's always worth a shot. Someone go get hatches. Be advised. Okay, so they got that. I usually put some air going that way, but so I have out cams. It'd be nice if they looked at me. But... You drawing me out? I should have saw them. Both above. Op four, last operator standing. You're not trying to hold that. Op four eliminated. Mission success. Good shit. That's a 3 0 on defense. That's the best start we can have. But you also want to never get too overconfident and play too overconfident because, like, even though it's 3-0, people can still make comebacks. Like, if I was on the attack right now, I'd still be hyping up my team. I'd still be like, we got this. Okay, it's a whole different game. Once you have that attack, to def like, defense, like, flip, it's a whole new ball game. And, like, the number one rule in R6 is literally just don't get upset at yourself. Don't get upset. Don't be like, uh, what the fuck, or start hating your teammates. Think about what you did wrong. Calm more. 
Did I, did I fucking quick peek? Did I get information first? Did I not drone? Like, think about how you died and play smarter the next time. It could be 0 and 3, and there's been so many games where I made comebacks, playing ranked, playing with people unranked. Just keeping your mood alive. You can't bring yourself down. You can't die two rounds in a row off the bat and be like, okay, I'm the shittest player. Okay, I'm ass. Sorry, guys, I'm just doing shit. Like, no, lock in. Even if you die, you can still give someone comps and help out. Like, in my opinion, R6 does not matter on KD. You could be fucking 2 and 7, 0 oh and 8, dude. I don't care. Like, if you're calming out and you're just helping your team, like, beneficial with the operators, it's just, it, it's literally just helping your team so much. And you just don't realize it. I'm going to get on top of that. Five seconds to go. Kind of like in this corner. You found a bomb. Make your way to I got a good drone cam, like in sight. <sighs> yeah, so our team is doing really good right now. But even though it's like they're not talking like back, you never know how your team is actually feeling because, um, well, you're not them and they're not responding. But like, I'm telling you, these things right now are helping. Them. Open. So I'm gonna pop this. Oh my! Wait, one cap can trap. I need you to hold drone. Yeah, I got you. No, there definitely is someone upstairs. There's two in lockers. Down. There's two in lockers. Aruni is just crouched on head holes in the lockers. You might even be able to pre-fire it. I can't remaining. mark. Can't see a lot. I've been marking that the whole time. Five seconds remaining. Yeah. It's fine. We just need one one round. That's it. I died to fucking Capkin traps, bro. Five v four. One minute left. We gotta play more aggressive. I was also using my line scans, not just for me, but also for my team. Hopefully, hoping that they would use it, maybe. Fuck you. Don't want your bitch ass my strike. Yo, you got another one in here, dude? Giving you eyes on the hostiles. We'll drop the diffuser. Oh, that's reinforced. Finally, that's fucking shit's gone, dude. Uh, somebody's close in that room. I already heard him. Ten seconds left. One on four remaining. Five seconds Fuck, left. Plant, plant, plant. Oh shit. The time limit has been reached. Okay, so this is an easy win. We just fucking forgot the fucking defuse. <laughs> there we go. You found a bomb. Your way to its Yo, I have a cam on the whole entire staff room B site. Nobody's in B site. Okay, when did that happen? Oh, my camera can't see that Yo, corner. Uh, they're all on A site. Doc is on one ping. Yeah, that I literally thought there was no one in, so I was gonna run in to site. And it's just completely my fault. I should have realized there was a blind spot on my cam. Doc is right. Doc, damn. Doc is pinched in the corner. Doc is crouched and he's pinched in that corner. He can't move. He's aiming at you. He's swinging you, Amara. Ace, you can hop in. Flash is on one ping. Ah, uh, I really wish I would have known that there was a guy in that corner. I was just gonna swing, rotate, swing big, and then just crouch behind something. I did not know you could shoot through that. But that's good shit. 
Um, I'm probably gonna make a part two of this video in the future. I just need to get the best teammates. Usually when I do this, I actually get good teammates that will like talk back and all that. I'm not saying my teammates are bad. They're really fucking good. But I'm saying like talk back, you know, like act like a five stack. Like you will see the improvement you get when you start hyping up your teams, bro. But like, see, where's fucking team of all time? If he was shitting on this team the whole time, all it does is bring down the team more. All it does is make them mad, them upset, them feel worse. But like, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. 20 likes for the next video, and I hope you guys.